Hi, Clico. I'm back to know more about computers. Today, I want to know more about the keyboard. Welcome back, Rini. I have told you that the keyboard is one of the important part of a computer. Do you remember what a keyboard is used for in a computer? <laughs> well, then the keyboard is a device which is used for typing in the computer. It contains many buttons on it, which are called keys. Do you know how many buttons are there on a standard keyboard? Well, no. There are 104 keys on a standard keyboard. Yes, I can see alphabets and numbers on the keyboard. Yes, the keyboard contains 26 alphabet keys from A to Z. We can type words and sentences in the computer using the alphabet keys. The number keys are also called the numeric keys. It consists of numbers from 0 to 9, which are the basic numbers. The numeric keys are used for typing numbers. What are these arrow keys for Clico? The arrow keys are called the directional keys to point to direction up, down, left and right. They are used to move the cursor in any direction on the computer screen. Liko, what are these keys on top of the keyboard? They are named from F1 to F12. They are the functional keys. They are used to perform special jobs. What are these two big keys which have enter written on them? They are the enter keys. They are located at two places in the keyboard. The enter key is used to move the cursor to the next line while typing. Which is the long key at the bottom of the keyboard? That is the space bar key. It is the longest key in the keyboard. It is used to give a blank space between letters or words while typing. Rennie, can you see the key on the left side of the keyboard, which has caps locks written on it? Yes, Liko. What is it used for? When you wish to type letters in the capital case, then you need to press this key first and then start typing. All the letters will appear in the capital case. Yes, now I know. What most of the keys on the keyboard does. Thank you, Clicko.